Imagine if every dollar in your wallet could tell its entire history. That's the revolution blockchain is bringing to finance, and it's happening right now. JP Morgan Chase is leading the charge, using this technology to transform money market funds. Let's uncover why they are leveraging blockchain for provenance, the traceable record of an asset's history and ownership. JP Morgan Chase is tokenizing money market funds, or investment vehicles that invest in short-term debt securities such as T-bills and commercial paper. We then have solutions around tokenizing money market functions. So when we think about you know, an asset manager client who's offering you know, their clients a money market fund product, often those clients will need to redeem out of the money market fund to go and post collateral for some you know, bilateral exposure or derivatives um, in a margin call, for example. That's not a great experience for the asset manager nor for the clients. Uh, it's costly, it's expensive, there's a drawdown on you know, the investment itself. We have come up with a solution and that allows for these investor clients to stay invested in the money market fund and actually post those shares, the, the money market fund shares, as collateral. Better experience, much cheaper for the client, um, you know, not a drag from the balance sheet perspective. And we think that this idea of you know, leveraging blockchain for the collateral industry is really, really important because of the size of that industry. This utilizes JP Morgan's Onyx blockchain platform to convert money market fund shares into digital tokens. Each token represents an ownership share in the fund, reflecting the value of the underlying short-term debt securities. Traditionally, investors have to withdraw money from money market funds to use it elsewhere, which is costly and halts their earnings. By converting these funds into digital tokens using blockchain, the shares can be easily transferred or used without withdrawal, allowing investments to remain active and reducing costs. While the benefits of tokenizing financial assets are clear, and collateral usage without liquidating the asset is a great example, let's focus on the three core benefits blockchain provenance brings to the table. 1. Detailed traceability and verification. In the context of the tokenized money market fund shares, blockchain meticulously records each transaction. This ensures that every exchange, pledge, or release of collateral is traceable and verifiable. All parties involved can access a clear and accurate history of the shares use as collateral, enhancing trust and transparency in financial dealings. For example, similar to how a barcode on a package allows tracking from warehouse to delivery, blockchain lets investors track the life cycle of their investment in real time. 2. Immutable record keeping. The tokenization of money market fund shares on a blockchain offers a definitive record of transactions that cannot be altered retroactively. This immutability is crucial when these shares serve as collateral, as it prevents any dispute over the terms of the agreement or the state of the collateral at any given time. 3. Robust security. By decentralizing the record keeping through blockchain, the security of these tokenized shares is significantly enhanced. This decentralized approach makes it exceedingly difficult for unauthorized parties to manipulate the records, thereby safeguarding the assets against potential fraud. In addition to enhancing provenance, this blockchain integration streamlines financial operations and ensures robust compliance. By automating the management and verification of transactions, JP Morgan's Onyx platform significantly reduces the time and cost associated with traditional asset management. If you found this explanation on the benefits of blockchain provenance insightful, remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates on how the blockchain is transforming finance. Check out these videos to stay ahead of the curve. Also let us know in the comments what new transformation the financial sector will see next.